So Call of Duty Black Ops 6 is set to launch on October the 25th, just in a few days, and the game's full trophy list has surfaced online ahead of its release. And there are in total of 45 trophies that will be available for the players to unlock. Now the breakdown includes 1 platinum, 4 gold, 8 silver and 31 bronze trophies. However, there is a significant drawback for the PlayStation 5 users. So the PlayStation 5 version doesn't actually feature the platinum trophy itself, leaving it with just 44 trophies in total. And of course if you wish to earn the platinum trophy in itself, unfortunately players will have to play the PlayStation 4 version of Call of Duty Black Ops 6, which is really is ludicrous in my opinion. Let's start from the Platinum Trophy itself, Decorated Agent, unlock all trophies in Call of Duty Black Ops 6. Now we're afterwards getting into the Gold Trophies. There are 4 in total, Case and Point, Complete the Campaign on Veteran Difficulty, Dipped in Gold, Purchase all Safe House and Players Upgrade in Campaign, The Puzzles, Mason, Complete all Safe House Puzzles in a Campaign. World Domination, in Liberty Falls, tap into your supervillain side, interesting. Next we're getting into the Silver Trophies, Case Closed, complete the campaign on any difficulty. Covert Agent, reach the guild meeting without breaking stealth. Full Clear, complete every POI on a attack map. Return of the King, enter Prestige 1. Show Off, earn a Mastery Badge for any weapon. The Pale Horse arrives, get 500 eliminations in a multiplayer, podium finish, win 25 multiplayer matches, bye bye Dark Aether, help the lost scientist complete his experiment. Unexpected move, complete Bishop takes Rook on any difficulty, talent acquisition, complete blood feud on any difficulty, breaking news, complete most wanted on any difficulty, bunker buster, complete hunting season and a cradle. Head Games, Complete Emergence on any difficulty, Jackpot, Complete High Rollers on any difficulty, Grounded, Complete Grounded Control on any difficulty, Constellation Prize, Complete Under the Radar on any difficulty, Capital Punishment, Complete Separation Anxiety on any difficulty, Buried at Sea, Complete Checkmate on any difficulty. These were all of the trophies that are a part of the story missions. Party is over, perform 5 takedowns without being spotted. Skewer and Winged Beast make the SAM target itself. Bulldozer, crush 25 enemies with the tank. David vs Goliath, destroy the APC using an RCXD. Seek and destroy, get 2 kills with remote throwing knife. Rapid reflexes, get 5 headshot kills with an adrenaline stim. Close combat specialist, perform 10 takedowns. Destructive Wake, get 5 kills with a score streak. Rush Hour, get double kill with the RCXD. Red Carpet, get featured in the best play 3 times. Doing your part, complete the training course. Betrayal, kill an enemy from behind while disguising. Heavy Ordnance Specialist, destroy 50 aerial score streaks. Stylish Skill, get 75 kills with an active perk. No more Modi, get out of the jail. Culinary Delight, eat a fish cooked with a specialist ingredient. Treasure Hunter, find a final talisman. Deadwood, achieve a sporting high score. To know your enemy, get 100 kills with mutant injection. Summarized, research all augments for 10 times. Annihilation, get 100 elite zombie eliminations. From the first point of view, it seems like these trophies are going to be relatively simple and straightforward. But of course, the ones that just don't make much sense, at least what you were required of doing, well, they can be quite a nightmare. Especially, we've already seen there's going to be plenty of easter eggs, things that are miscellaneous, and of course, the difficulty will be included within this Call of Duty. I'll say I don't believe it's going to be as hard as usual older schools types of Call of Duty games in terms of the platinuming it, but of course we are only judging this from the names of the trophies and the description. Well at that, thank you so much for watching, like and subscribe, see you guys all, and do let me know as well, are you going to get that platinum trophy within the Call of Duty Black Ops 6, or perhaps you're not even going to bother picking up the game. I'll see you guys all, and uh, yeah, have a good one.